Well, we are closing in on the pointy end of this year's Santos Tour and Under for 2017. And I'm on top of Wollonga Hill, where later today could very well decide the winner of this year's tour. Now, over the week, I've been taking part in fan cam and showcasing what this beautiful state and city has to offer. And if you've missed what I've done over the past seven days, here's a quick look back. Opening night at the village last week where the teams were presented Birds of Tokyo rocked Victoria Square, and I had my colours lowered by Mia. Yeah, yeah! Sunday was family day around the course at Victoria Park with the Booper family ride, and I got to talk to a group of friends taking on the People's Choice Undies run with mixed emotion. $20,000 is magnificent, so I'm sure she's watching from above thinking, who is that guy interviewing him, and he should have his undies on as well. <laughs> well, I think we're all thinking the same thing. <laughs> On Monday morning, I got to spend time in the saddle with the one and only, the voice of cycling, Mr. Phil Liggett. I was very impressed, but there's not much of you, and I needed more protection from the wind. Tuesday night, and it was the final stage of the women's tour. I then spent a day on the road with a group of Kiwi cycling fanatics. We had a combined birthday party uh, one month ago, and we called it 160. Ride by two, you'll get her age. After catching up with Jens Voigt at the Booper Challenge group meeting on Thursday, I then headed out on the Booper Challenge around the Adelaide Hills. What dreams are made of. Let's say these hills. They're meant for men, not mountain goats. Men. After taking the heartbreaking climb up Checker Hill in my stride, it was time to fly down Gorge Road on my way to the finish line. We have crushed a massive week of the Santos Tour and Under into fan cam this year, but it's not over yet. Tomorrow I'll show you another great event on the Tour and Under bucket list and happens right here on Wollonga Hill.